Good morning. Welcome to Froggy School. Today, I decided that we are going to learn about fractions in Minecraft. So you can see I am on Kurgan's Minecraft world and have created our little school that I've started here. Let me go ahead and take you inside. So you can see there's not much here. So there's some extra work that I was playing with and I made myself a desk. So let me show you what we look like in Minecraft. So hello, I am Mrs. Vian Temshi and I am your teacher today. So as I said, we are going to learn about fractions. And before we learn about fractions, we need to review something that you learned last year. Fair share or equal parts. What does that mean? It means everybody's happy. Each person that's getting the item is happy because they each have the same amount. So we're going to look at some examples and we're going to see, can you find the sets that show how we fair share? So here we have number one and we look at this right here and we have one group that has one, two, three, four diamond blocks. Is that fair share? Well, let's look at the other side. One, two. Hmm. Which side would you pick? I'd pick this one because there's more. So is that equal? Is that the same? No, it's not. So this is not fair share. Let's go ahead and look at our second example here. Number two, is this fair? Hmm. Well, they look the same, but let's walk around and make sure they are the same. Nothing hiding. Let's count them. One, two, three. Well, there's three emerald blocks there and one, two, three emerald blocks there. Is that the same? Is that equal? Yes. So this is fair share. So now we know this is not fair share and this is fair share. So, so far, so good. Let's keep going. So here, oh, this looks a little bit harder. Let's see. Number three, is this fair? Well, let's see. I've got, looks like four different sets. So let's count them. One, two in this set. One, two in this set. One, two in this set. And one, two in this set. So there's four sets of two. Is that fair? Yes. If you had four people and they each got two blocks, they would be happy because they all have the same amount. Okay, let's do one more example and then we're going to see how we fair share and then you're going to take a test. So here's number four. Is this fair? Hmm, we've got a big tower here, a small tower here, and two equal towers there. Let's see. Hmm, okay, so let's go one, two, three, four. That seems like a lot. And then we have a tower of one, two. Mm, I can already tell this is not fair, but let's keep going. One, two, and one. So is this fair? No, but you know what? It's fun because I can bounce on my slime blocks. So, so far we have two examples of not fair and two examples of fair. So see how they're the same height? They are equal. Everybody would be happy. So let's see, how do we fair share? So if I have a cookie or some candy, I want to make sure everybody gets the same amount. So if we're dividing it into two parts, I'm going to give one item to the person number one, and then I'm going to give an item to person number two an item to person number one, an item to person number two, an item to person number one, an item to person number two, an item to person number one, an item to person number two. So is this fair? Yes, it is fair because everybody got four blocks. So now that we've reviewed that fair share means everybody gets the same amount, 
let's take our test. Is this fair share? Each side, is each side the same or equal? So let's check. Okay, so we've got, oh, hmm. I'm going to let you count. How many is on this side? And then how many is on this side? So what do you think? Is it equal? Is it fair share? You have to decide. So tomorrow we're going to go over what fractions are and why fair share is important with our fractions. So until tomorrow, keep popping. <laughs>